here is Cave Creek Road here. And we're leaving Carefree, Arizona and heading into Cave Creek. And here we come into Cave Creek. We've got Stagecoach Village up here. That's actually new, guys, the Stagecoach Village. All right, so just a little bit of history about Cave Creek. It is in Maricopa County, just north of Phoenix. Uh, the population is around 5,000. If you combine Cave Creek and Carefree, it's neighbor town. It's about 10 to 15,000 population. It was founded and settled in 1870 by soldiers coming through from Fort McDowell. But in 1873, prospectors from the Bradshaw Mountains found gold in the town. And the way it gets its name, Cave Creek, is because there's a big cave up the creek where the town gets its name. Native Americans used to live in that cave and in the surrounding areas around the creek because there was a fertility of water and uh, fish and whatnot in the creek. Arizona. Many of you guys have already heard about this motorcycle town, old western feel. There's the hideaway. And a really old restaurant bar right here called the Horny Toad. But we are approaching this fire that's burning in an area called Rancho Manana. But as we drive there, I decided to film and show you guys Cave Creek usually a really pleasant place to be at the base of Black Mountain there. My brother's a real estate agent and we both grew up here in Cave Creek and uh, we know this place really well because this is where we used to ride our bikes. This Dairy Queen's been there for years. But if you guys are looking to buy a house, what do you think? You think you could help them find one here? Yeah, give me a call. 480-548-2229. Nice. But uh, unfortunately, we're showing them this fire that is really closing a lot of the streets. That's my old elementary school. That used to be an elementary school. That was Cave Creek Elementary School. What is that now? They're turning into shopping. Wow. Yeah, I used to go to, oh, that's where I went to kindergarten. Schoolhouse Road. Schoolhouse Road, yeah. A real old school city, this uh, Cave Creek here. There are active evacuations in place right now too. They've evacuated a, you know, a significant portion of area north of Cave Creek Road here and unfortunately there have been a few homes that have been burned as well. I used to work at the uh, Rancho Manana Golf Course. Wow look at that. Look at that tanker. And actually I was telling my brother I said I used to work at Rancho Manana which is where the fire was when I was 15 years old, 16 years old. I worked there for two summers and I used to go into the creek bed down there and it's very lush. So this is a high desert, very lush desert, and uh, I could see why it would be a lot of combustible for fire to burn. They also used to work here at El Encanto. It's a great Mexican restaurant if you ever get a chance. El Encanto Mexican restaurant. They got, um, it's, I think it's El Encanto Mexican Cafe, is that what it's called? Um, El Cantina. They have a uh, nice pond in there and a great ambiance, good food too. Wow, unbelievable what's going on here. So the fire appears to be burning northwest of where we are. Yeah, we said it's about 400 acres already burned. Cave Creek will be fine. It will survive. You know, in the 20 years that I lived in Cave Creek, uh, there was never a fire on this side of town. And the last month, there's been two fires basically on this side of Cave Creek. Unbelievable. Is the fire at Rancho Manana or is it, it over here? Back there, but it's, it's, spread. it's spread, yeah. It just keeps spreading. You can see it, guys. There's been some houses that have already burned. That's sad. Could you imagine, you know, this morning you woke up in your house and now... Now what?
this is actually where Rancho Manana's entrance is, so this would have been where it would have started. See it back in the background there. Oh wow, look at that tanker. Whoa, man. So this is the back end of Cave Creek here, on Cave Creek Road. on this side of Black Mountain, which is facing west, so this is the side you'll get the sunset. These homes, the prices range anywhere between 500,000 on a low end, if you're lucky, with one, two acres, all the way up to millions of dollars the higher up you go up the mountain. This road here is called Sunset Trail. But now this is the west side of Black Mountain. You get a different look of Black Mountain than you get from Carefree, that's for sure. We're just going to cruise around this neighborhood here and show you guys what it looks like over here. There is more to Cave Creek than what I'm showing you, but we didn't go out onto that plateau in between Black Mountain and Elephant Butte, all the way up into like Skull Mesa. Don't worry about the name, it sounds worse than it really is up there, it's really beautiful. There's a place up there that you'll wanna check out if you get a chance called Spur Cross. You can even go over towards the creek, towards Cahava Ranch, lots of areas out in Cave Creek on that plateau. But because this was the day that there was a fire, we didn't go out there. Some great views up here, I'll tell you what. So now we're headed back up Cave Creek Road towards Carefree. You'll see the other side of the street here. Another area I used to ride my bike when I was growing up as a kid hasn't changed very much I mean it's undergone some renovation but for the most part it still looks the same this is actually the north side of Black Mountain big earls whoa that used to be called the treehouse y'all it's no longer there Chip, or Outlaws right here. That was the Outlaws. This is the Buffalo Chip right there. And then here is Harold's. I used to go here as a kid. We all used to go here as a kid. And here is the Roadhouse. If you like to ride motorcycles, this is where you're gonna wanna be. Little Cave Creek, Arizona. And now we're approaching Carefree. <laughs> so this is the start of the Black Mountain Trailhead. Oh wow. Off school. 
Pool House Road towards Black Mountain right there. These are those washes that get going with water when it rains. And the world famous quails. building a big house up there. What are they building up there? Yeah, it looks like somebody's uh, big old home. Whoa. And that'll do it from Cave Creek. There is another video of Carefree if you guys want to see that on this channel. And we'll see you guys on the next video.